Hello everyone, I'm your host, Boss Zombie. Welcome back to Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door Remake. Let's keep going through town. Looking for this guy who do Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, anything over here? Nope. Hey, 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 oh, I've got all the hottest new products right here. Look no further. Oh, you have the W emblem? And double pane. I can't afford that. I can't afford most of these things. Well, I can afford everything except that, really. What? No more shopping? Sorry to hear that, my man. This is a limited time offer. I change the goods I offer from time to time, so I come back real soon, okay? You smell that? It smells like a profitable situation. Yes, indeedy. Looks like my star is finally starting to shine. Now that not that it's any of your business. Uh, how do you get to the second story with the bad shop? I think you go through here, right? Ooh. Oh, I used to sail around and run wild in my younger days, but I'm a reformed sailor now. I was blowing up north, south, east, and west back then. Just about blew up the whole flipping map. At the top means scram. Don't talk to me. My heart's burning for my long lost love. Oh, Miss Mouse, you sly, sultry little thief. I hope you're doing well wherever you are. Is this Fabio? Ah, what are you doing? Sneaking up on a person as he sings most jovially. Who? Me, you ask about? Ah, I'm called Flavio. That's right. I am, how you say? A traitor. The richest man in Rogueport. Okay, we'll do deal with him much later. Welcome to you and yours. Have a seat. This is Podley's Place, a humble little cola shop where folks mix stories and drinks. By the by, there's an inn upstairs. When you're weary, go on up and relax. I like your little drawing of a cat in the box. It's cute. Oh, here's Toadsworth. Oh, oh, Master Mario, what could her highness be doing? The mind reels. Please don't waste another moment. You must find the princess. You must. Oh, there's the key. Boy, who could this be? Welcome, welcome. Feel free to look around. What is this? Changes the background music to the... Really? Big welcome to you, yes. Welcome to the lovely house of badges. You are so welcome here. Now, I know a new customer when I see one, so let me give my usual rundown on how our shop works. A special curated selection of recommended badges up here on the counter. If you're looking for something more niche, check in the cardboard box on the right side of the shop. I covers the basics for using our shop, but do you want me to explain? No. Okay, moving right along. We need zero BP to wear this in a challenge. Yeah! That's neat. I mean, I'm not going to use it because I want to hear the new soundtrack, but... That's the badge manager at the lovely House of Badges. For a manager, she sure has gone from the store a lot. Where do you think she goes? The shop's small, but it's totally adorable. She really knows how to decorate. Boy, I wonder where she goes. What interesting shaped tail she has. A big welcome to you. Welcome. Uh. Oh, I can sell badges. Right. Oh, some of these are worth good money, actually. Oh. I don't really have any I want to sell right now, though. No. Oh, stomach. Hey, behave. Which one's a super appeal? Power. Power jump. I have power bounce. Sleepy stomp. Close call. Oh, that wouldn't be bad. Oh, okay, here we go. We're throwing FP during battle. Okay. Oh, piercing blow would be very nice to get. Last stand. Oh. Close. Oh, I can get another close call. Simplifier and unsimplifier. Okay. I'll have to come back and do this. Oh, you know, there's something I want to check if I can even get there yet, but I wonder how the lottery works in this game. Because in the original, there was a lottery that you would buy a ticket and then every day you could check to see what you won. You didn't have to buy another ticket after that. But basically, you wouldn't win anything until at least a year had passed, and then you start winning stuff. But if you tried to mess with the GameCube's clock, it pretty much every time would be able to tell and you would have to buy a new ticket all over again. But I wonder with how the Switch does its clock. I wonder if people figured out a way around it. If it's even in this game anymore. Who knows? Housekey. 
Yes, my key! I can finally get inside my house again. Home sweet home, thank you. Please take this as payment for your efforts, alright? Oh, neat. 30 coins? You shouldn't have. Can I come inside? I saw a shine sprite behind his house. Hey, we don't have much here, but make yourself at home if you want. It's a nice, actually, not a bad house. Oh, I bet I need... Okay, I need the partner. I, oh, wait. Yeah, I need a... Hello, in the foreground. No, let's do another trouble. I mean, I'll just do all the troubles avail to, available to me now, right? Safe delivery. This is Mick Goomba, and I have a simple task. I need to have something delivered. Unfortunately, for reasons I won't mention, I can't be seen walking around Rogueport. Maybe behind Zesty's house on Rogueport Square. Yeah. Alright. Well, Zesty is the angry looking lady. I'm walking around the left side, so. I will put him in this alley. I don't like that it doesn't just flip, it has that weird black transition. Like, it doesn't want to show what it has to load. <laughs> Shoot, yesterday I blew through 200 coins of the party, I believe that. But next time... Okay, so I have been back here, that's where the bandit was. Oh, this guy, right! You never know who'll be watching, so let's do this thing quick. Take this package to Goomfree, you'll find him in front of Frankly's place. Try not to be seen. You got a box. The thing McGoomba asked you to deliver to Goomfree. Man, this game's good. They don't make him like this anymore, quite literally. Super Mario just hasn't been the same. I would assume that this is Goomfree. The loading time is surprising, considering... Well, I guess this game does have a lot to it. The package. Yep, that's it. I'll dispose of this in a way no one will ever find it. Tell Magoomba I said so. And do me a favor, forget all this, you hear me? It never happened, for your sake. We never spoke. Forget everything. When you give Magoomba a message, he'll give you your compensation. Remember, this deal won't be done until you give my message to Magoomba. Luigi, you didn't hear a thing. It's for your own good. I think a few of those troubles make you go into like the pit of 100 trials, which isn't fun. Did you deliver it? Phew, you saved my neck, buddy. Oh, I almost forgot your compensation. You saved my neck, you get something good. Hey, another 30 coins. Not bad. Well, now I want to see. That'll leave me... Let me go give that... that Ratui. Ratui, what a good name. The noose is so odd that they decided to keep it. Like, they could have left the gallows exactly how they were and just removed the noose. Although, I'm sure people then would have complained. Yes, yes, I'm gonna give you more. No, I don't get anything from him until, what, chapter 6, they said? Yeah, okay. Think you'd be willing to invest so much money into my endeavor. This should be more than enough. I promise you, I will strike oil. So expect good news. Now, my benefactor Mario, thanks to you and your coins, I'm ready to get out there and strike it rich. Your timing's perfect, I was just about to leave, and I'm so excited to begin my adventure, I'm shaking. Okay, good luck. So, it's an investment, I get... 300% of what I put in? No, 333% of what I put in? Does your inventory change every time I go to a new screen? No. I want that W emblem, though. Wait. Don't you normally get the W emblem all the way in, like, Chapter 6? I just put that together. Yeah, he normally doesn't sell that. Or is it the L emblem you get? Hmm. 
Maybe it's just a new thing, so you have an opportunity to get it before then? Uh, competitor research. This is Arfur. I want to open a new shop, but I need to help. I need help setting my prices. Since I can't go into competitor shop, I need some research done. I need the price of fire flowers, sleepy sheep, and tasty tonics. Reach in front of this building to make the exchange. Yes. Fire flowers, sleepy sheep, tasty tonic. Fire flowers, sleepy sheep, tasty tonic. Okay. Fire flower, sleepy sheep, tasty tonic. They're all alliteration items, so it shouldn't be hard. They're not healing items either. Okay, so fire flower. So 10, 8, 3. Yeah, okay. That's all I needed to know. 10, 8, 3. 10, 8, 3. His name is Arthur. Because they're like dog people. I'm not sure what species they are. Does she tell me? Arthur, he's always hanging around here. Hmm. Check prices? Yes. Okay, I'm ready. First, how much are they asking for fire flowers? It was 10, 8, 3. I see. And for sleepy sheep, 8. Okay. How about Tasty Tonic? How much is that? 3. Wow, that's rough. Those are some low prices. I can't believe they're selling that low. Hmm, even if I try to compete with them, I don't think I can profit. But it is certainly helpful information. Here's your reward. Good work. Neat. Uh, find this guy. Hey, 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 hey. My name is Goomther. Please find the guy that pulled off credit card fraud on me. When Rogueport swears to come talk to me. Oh, now we deal with this guy. I don't remember where he was. Well, it had to be somewhere I could get to before I beat Gus. Was it the guy behind... It might be the guy behind the fake wall there? Let me talk to him first. Dugan, that's what they're called. Maybe they're supposed to be like, doggone? No, Dugan. Oh, you're Gunther. Hey, you're here to handle my trouble, aren't you? Then listen up. Larson the Bandit pulled some credit card fraud on me and took my dough. I want to rough him up for it, but this guy is too wise and I can never catch him. He's heading somewhere here in Rogueport, and I want you to find him. Oh, the bandits are those guys in the blue outfits who wear masks. There are several in Rogueport, but this one will fess up when you grill him. Do this, and then you'll get reward. I'm counting on you. Let's go shake down the bandit. I think he's the one back here. Near Darkly, or whatever that dude's name was. You got a problem? What are you looking at? Unless you've got business with me, Scram. What? You want me to return the money I swindled? What are you, the fraud police? Sheesh, how'd I let myself get caught? Wait, do I gotta chase him repeatedly? No. Oh, sorry. Hey, 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 did you find Larson? The guy's on the verge of giving himself up, so don't worry about what he'll do. Keep after him until you catch him. The bandits are in blue. Yeah, I know. I like his name is Larson. Okay, I'm betting he's outside somewhere. It's just a matter of... Which one he is. Hmm. Unless... I mean, he's not going to be in here with the other bandit, is he? No. Okay. Alright, let's head to West Rogueport. Let's uh, go step on a contact first, though. Oh, anything new here? While looking for badges in Hooktail's castle, I ran into a spiffy mustached fellow. Heart stealing thief. Hooktail of Petal Meadows, defeated by Brave Hero. Must have been a tough guy. 
Freeze! You two, not another step. Don't come this way. Some complete jerk just bumped into me and made me lose a contact lens. I'm looking for it right now, so don't you dare move. You hear me? Whatever you do, do not move an inch. Not an inch, you hear? I've always been curious about this, but can I actually stand still for a while and she'll find it? Uh, I think her name is Zesty, right? Not Zed. Uh, contact lens. Aha, uh -huh, ba da ba da. Contact lens comes in after the current chapter from when it was ordered. Oh, so I should have done this before. Wait, so I can't even do this yet? Uh-oh. That might have been a bad move. Uh, hmm. Ah, idiot! You stepped on it! My poor contact lens! I told you not to move! Don't your stupid ears work? What were you thinking? This is your fault. Now I have to buy a new contact lens, but you're gonna pay for it! Compensate me, Mr. Clumsy. Fine. If that's your plan, then here's mine, you oaf. I'm gonna block the gate to the west side until you bring me a new contact lens. Oh, no. Well, that kind of throws... Where do I get it? If I can't get it... No. Look, I'm not letting you into the west part until you buy me a new lens. Sorry, but end of story. I can't cook anything with my contact lenses in. Ah, my rage is so hot right now, I could cook you with it. Uh-oh. This possible quality of life thing... Something the matter, sir? Yeah, what's that? You want a contact lens, you say? Mm, just wait a moment. Gee, fellow, I'm sorry, but we don't have any stock right now. Tough luck, I know. I can special order one right away for you, but it'll take a while. Check back soon, okay? Okay, well... Shoot. That's a problem. Uh... Let me see, maybe this got changed in the remake. Otherwise, I can't do much else here. Uh, contact lens. Let's see if I make it the past, I don't know, month or so. Okay, well, game 8 has a guide, and they're usually solid. Um, purchase in Toad's Bazaar. Oh, I blew it. I should have talked to her in the last one. Wait, you can't cook life mushrooms anymore? Interesting. Okay, well. I don't want to get distracted. Okay. I did... The wiki did say that if you sleep... But only in chapter after chapter two it'll come in. But let's try. Yes. Oh, that sucks though. If I can't, oh, let's skip this. Okay, thank you. I'm out of here. Need I needed to heal anyways, I guess. Please have it. Hmm. That's not great. That's not great at all. What if... What if I start Chapter 2 and come back? Oh, wait! Dear Mary, thank you for shopping. The Toad Bros are writing to let you know the context is... Oh, okay! Assuming you can still see well enough to read this email. Oh, I just had to leave the area, I guess? Okay. Bullet dodged. I can go to the west part of town. Boy, that would have been unfortunate. Hey, valuable customer, your contact lens is in. Please drop by our shop. 
Oh, is this he's dead? Oh, yeah. <laughs> An aid for poor vision. Is Mario really need this? Can you imagine a contact lens only costing $10? And it seems by the crunching effect that it's a solid one. Did you bring my contact lens, Mr. Squishy? There you go. Oh, sweet relief. Thank you. Finally, the world is crisp and clear again. I can see. Oh, I'm so happy. Be careful from now on. People don't generally like having their stuff stomped on. Okay. Uh, do I have anything I need to really cook? Uh, hmm. Maybe later. Actually, let me, let me cook one thing just to see if anything's significantly changed. Ooh, the west side. Oh, so it's you again, huh, Mr. Stompalot? Well, my name is ST. I may not look like a chef, but I'm actually quite good. I mean, you look like a chef. If you me ingredients, my cooking skills burst life and culinary magic happens. Let me whip up something for you right now. Yeah, cook one of these bad boys. Wait a sec while I flex my culinary muscles. doodle doo da Sorry to keep you waiting. I'm not entirely sure you'll like this, but... Go on, take it, Stompy. Ooh, mushroom fry. Oh, that's actually... That's really good. Okay, I'll do those. I'll make more of those later. What happens if you cook a... Honey syrup? What does that give you? Ah, uh, how refreshing. This is my favorite place. It's the only peaceful area in all of Roadport. Oh, another day, another stupid losing lottery ticket. We sure I'll win tomorrow. Yeah, I'll be back tomorrow. I'll, I'll be here until tomorrow. Oh, yeah, this is the lottery. Okay, I'll... Well, I get the... dum da dum do doo Every day is a lucky day with happy lucky lottery. With new numbers every day, the lottery's fun and exploding with excitement. Let me tell you more. Tell me more. Happy lucky lottery is so special. You pick numbers, they might win each day. Buy your lottery ticket here, one at a time. Buy another if you change your mind. And check back later on this board to see if your number has come in. If your number matches the day's draw, you get a super happy lucky prize. The day's number is drawn each night at midnight. If you play and check the board every day, your number is sure to come in eventually. When I say midnight, I mean according to your clock at home. No. Uh... No. I will do this later once I look into how it works. That's so unhappy. Yes, that's too bad. We'll come back when you feel like playing the Happy Lucky Lottery. I like that this is just the gambling side of town. Even though the lottery is not really gambling. You buy it one time, you just every day can get something. I almost fell down that great. Man, that was close. I know where that thing leads to, too. All too well. I don't want to go there. But I do. Wow, this town may be full of rogues and punks, but this part sure feels safe. Don Pianta does such a good job of managing things, I feel totally safe shopping here. Right, I'm still looking for a bandit. Well, I can find him over here, so... That's Pika, a boo that works at Westside Goods. She's so pretty and surprisingly unshy. I think her sister is Lala, the boo who works at the Pianta parlor. Oh, you can buy them here. I think you can buy them in the other town for cheaper, but... Huh. If that lottery thing, if I can get that working, I might be able to just stock up on those, which... Do those restore 10 or 5? Yeah, 10. Okay. Interesting. Wow, this is a nice house. My dad's writing a novel, but it'll never sell. It's terrible. Hey! Have some faith in your father. Oh, I need something for that. 
Yeah, my wife spends all day in the parlor, so I never get anywhere on my novel. I need to go off to places I've never seen to get inspired to write or something. Oh, maybe the bandits in the north part with the train. Do you normally just hang out on top of your bed? Shoes on and everything? Yet another day dwindles away while I loaf in bed doing nothing. Oh well, I am rich after all. I don't like you. I like your house though. The pink is ferocious. Okay, there's the cheap cheap conductor. This flight goes to Glitzville. You'll need a ticket to travel with us. I don't have one of those. Oh, the train. That's such a fun level. Actually, both of the levels associated with this area are really fun. I tell you, I like just standing here gazing at that train more than I would like riding it. Because if I were to ride it, I wouldn't get to see how cool this main engine looks. Yeah, looking at it's better. But if I could just afford a ticket, I might ride it once. It's the Excess Express bound for the luxurious Poshley Heights. Passengers must present a ticket to board. I don't have one. Ah, you gotta love train platforms, man. But this place has seen as many dramatic encounters as there are stars in space. Wow, the thought of it all. I just love it. I would like to take a, like, cross-state or cross-country train. I've been... Only train I've ever been on was, like, the tri-rail stuff over in South Florida. Which is pretty much just an express... It's a bus that moves faster. That's pretty much it. Well, let's check the parlor, otherwise we'll have to go check some of the buildings. Ooh. I love checking my scores in this machine after playing games. I'm here all day. What? My husband is worried about me. Oh, don't be silly. He doesn't mind. As long as he's writing, he doesn't notice what anyone else does. Oops. This place is run by the head of the Pianta Syndicate. You can play fun games in here and win Pianta tokens to redeem for prizes. Yeah, play to win and get those prizes. What other prizes do you have? Hey, hey, you're Mario, like the one and only. I know all about you. The Screen Princess Peach is important work, but even heroes need relaxation. What can I show you? What do you got? Oh, okay, cake mix is interesting. Oh! No, how do I get... Is this where you... Pianta Changer Changing Machine, I'm called Pianta Changer. I change one Pianta for three coins. Oh, interesting. Okay, it's good to know. Hey, how you doing? What? Me? I'm on top of the world, baby. What's that now? You want one of these members cards that increases the minigames you can play, do you? Well, let's see, maybe if you help someone in trouble, they'll give it to you. That's the goal. What nightmare lies down here? Oh, hmm. Hold on. Uh, well, no, I need to keep you, so I can't go to the left. Oh, I'm on the other side of the town. Is there something back here as well? They're sure in duty duty is. In duty duty, in duty duty. That's locked. Say, I've never seen your face around these parts. Who are you? Ha, huh, I get it. You're a wanted man above ground and can't be seen in town, eh? Huh? No? Oops, sorry. Sorry about that. Don't tell me this is him. Yo, Eddie the Mask here, sports extraordinaire. Sports fan extraordinaire. You know about stylish moves? The perfect timing during attack to pull a stylish move. If you're right, the crowd will just go wild and some attacks have multiple ones. Each attack has different timing for stylish moves, but I'll share one with you. Yeah, okay, I already know that one. Alright, thanks. Uh, I already forgot your name. No, oh, did you come here to do research too? Excuse me? You're an adventurer? Really? Wow. That's the first time I've ever heard anyone describe their occupation as adventurer. Well, hey now. Huh? Oh, I can step in this. Ooh, soft stomp's not bad. Is there 
no real reason to come back here? Okay. Oh, and can I... Hmm. No, oh, visitor, eh? Hey, man, this dude knows everything. He'll give you some seriously good advice. Of course, you'll have to pay him for it. Yeah, that's the way it goes. Hey, a pink bob bomb I know stuff, too. Seriously. Like, when the wind blows, the cradle will, fa will fall. I just don't know why it falls, because no one tells me. That's wonky. The go-to guy for useful info. He looks a bit iffy, but I think his tips are okay. So make sure you get your money's worth, not that you'll know until you pay. Howdy, my name is Wonky and I just know stuff. I may not look like much, but I know a thing or two, you'd better believe it. And who knows, the stuff I know may even be the stuff that can help you. When asking a question, just speak up and ask away. Five coins about the big door? Sure. Well, you know, there's a really big door down here. I've only seen it once myself, but if there really is some legendary treasure down here, it's behind that door. Yeah, when I saw it, I got the feeling there was bad stuff going on down there. In fact, I've been too heebie-jeebie to get near that door ever since. And that is that. If you need anything else, just ask Old Wonky. What else you got? Battle techniques? Sure. I hear the best way to fill up your audience is to succeed at action commands. Especially when you succeed at several in a row. Ooh, I hear that's great. Also, beating enemies quickly and striking first can build your crowd, too. That might be good to remember. Suppose that's all I have to say. Anything else? How many of these does he have? What's hidden below? Old Monkey just got this juicy bit of info recently. You know that small hole down here that can only, only a little critter can get through? Well, you just head out away from the wall there. And when you can't go any further, jump to get something good. If you see that hole, you should give it a try. I suppose that's all I have to say. Interesting. The Legend of Rogueport. How many pieces do you have? You heard about the legendary treasure hidden beneath Rogueport, right? Apparently it's the vast fortune of that ancient, forgotten civilization. Most people think that's just a silly old myth now, of course, but not wonky. According to my sources, it's the real deal. Huh? Who are my sources? Well, I can't really say, can I? That, my friend, is what's called a trade secret. I suppose that's all I have to say. Anything else? Sure, I got plenty of money, hopefully. So this really cute girl in a pink dress walking around town a while back. She was pretty enough to be a princess, I tell ya. She hung around town for a little while after buying something from that old lady. And she got nabbed in the back alley by a bunch of suspicious guys in white suits. I'm pretty sure I'm the only person who saw that, though. Old Wonky was scared. Well, I guess it's neither here nor there, and I probably shouldn't have spoken up before- I should have spoken up before now, so oops. Still, just knowing what's going on in the streets can be helpful sometimes. I suppose that's all I have to say. Sure. He has a lot of these. Something that's behind the sign. There's a billboard in front of the shop in town with all kinds of stuff written on it. Well, some folks like to write graffiti on the back of the message board, you know? There's all kinds of good stuff there, especially for an info guy like old Wonky. You should give it a gander next time. Okay, I already knew that one. I told you all the stuff I know. Of course, I might learn some new stuff soon, so check back with Wonky. Alright. This is a special refuge for all, where we cultivate information. Herb Tea's place. Sit back and enjoy yourself. Now, what have you got hanging up there? That's clearly garlic on the left, but is that just... Is that onions on the right? Or just brown garlic? Does garlic come in different colors? What's the point of being back here? Ooh. What is this thing? Slow mushroom. Oh. Gradual syrup and slow mushroom. Ultra shroom. Oh, you just sell gold bars. Okay. Hi there. Welcome to the Deep Down Depot. What can I do for you? Okay. She just sells gold bars. That's interesting. Right now, where is that... You said there's a hole that you got to squeeze through. 
Well, now that I look at it... Oh, you can just roll into that. Okay. Hmm. I'll just keep my eyes peeled for a... Oh, wait! He's talking about where the puny was. I found that already. Right. What are these things called? Like, Spanias or something? Right, so they don't have more than four. That's a Spania. Spania with spikes on its head. It looks meaner, too. Oh, but it's the same. It's just you can't jump on it. Watch out for the spikes in his head, but otherwise just wail on it. I gotta be honest though, the way that thing spins makes me want to yak. Nope, oh, way too soon. <laughs> I like that he gives a thumbs up afterwards too. Um, I guess you might as well just defend. Gotcha! Oh, I'm three quarters of the way to a new level. We still gotta find that bandit. Money. Why did I not switch first? Oh, I definitely need to switch for this one. Okay. Uh, let's do that first. Swap partner. Uh, it'll be so nice to get the quick change badge. Okay, if I can do it again, that'd be perfect. It's like the moment of contact. Oh, there's still dry bones in the audience. I figured they would have stayed at Mooktail's cast and there's a prana plant. Nice. How many star pieces do I have? Ooh, if I if I can get the one in oh the background was probably. Hmm. Okay, well I can't do anything on the left yet because I need the partner from chapter three. I'm imagining this pipe in front of me goes to the top. Where does this pipe go? Oh! different part of the... Okay. Oh. Hmm. Well, okay then. Lucky. Rather, I'm lucky it didn't... My side didn't fall. Oh, I am getting better at defending against that, at least. There's no way I level up from just the enemies down here. I need 19 more. That would be so many fights. There's nothing over there. No, I can hit them from them. That's cool. I was just curious. That's a lot of them. Hmm. Oh. Okay, that works. don't have it no more. Hey, what are you doing? I saw that rock, you little jerk. Oh, Luigi's in the audience. 
Come on, I was hoping the hoping the background would fall. I had it, and I don't got it. It's gone. I had it, and it's gone. Oh, fall. Dang. I guess it really is just rare that it falls. Alright, 15 more points. Hopefully there's nothing scary down here that I have to worry about. Oh! Anything cool up top and above it? No? Anything cool in here? No? Alright. I forget how involved the sewers are in this one. They were pretty in-depth in the first one, but here they're... Something else. Ah, oh, but what if I do this? Oh, and a gradual syrup. Okay. I don't remember those items. But they're not... I don't think they're new. I just must have never used them. Be good for a boss fight, though. What is this room? This was not in the original. Is this a fast travel hub? This was definitely not in the original. Hold on a second. Does this... No. Are you telling me they're going to have pipes straight to the towns now? Oh... My god. That's an incredible improvement. Wait, but how do I get to this room easily? Because otherwise I gotta run through a few enemies and annoyances. What does this button do? Uh-huh. No way! That's so easy! That's going to make revisiting places so much easier. That's locked. Wow, okay, so they have not just... They've just flat out added things to the game now. That's awesome. It's right there. That's so crazy. Uh, did I check the docks? I did not check the docks for the bandit. Hey, I found him. Cripes, the fraud police, you don't give up easily, do you? You can't make me pay. Where did he go? I mean, he's not going to visit old places. Did you see him? Hmm. Okay, so I do think he's going to be only outside. Which does limit... Okay, are you... there you are. That's not your house. Cripes, the fraud police. Ah, wheeze. Shoot, you're serious. Uh, fine, I'm a man. Do with me as you will. Hey, 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 hey. Okay, you caught him. Nice. Here's your reward. Money. So, since it looks like you're all out of dough, I'll take it out of your hide. Eek, no, please. Ah, huh, those are some scary implications. Oh, I was trying to see what... You can see through that little crack between the buildings. I thought it was like a star piece. It's just the Dugan guy there walking around. What'd you do with him? Oh. That's weird. That seems almost like an error, like he's supposed to not talk about it anymore. Alright. Let's do another trouble. How many more are there? Hit me, please? 
Mouse million here. I need to have some help jogging my memory. Meet me in Rogueport Square in front of the shop. Yeah. Do it and do it right. That hub room is for the traveling is incredible. I still can't believe that. That's awesome. Because that's always one of the problems is just going back to these places can be such a pain in the butt. Sniff, sniff, you accepted my trouble. I smell it. Thank you. I found a good lead on a way to make money, but I sort of forgot about it. So, I want to use two shock treatments to try to remember it. Yes, indeedy. Just keep... Excuse me. Hitting me in the head with the hammer until I remember. Be careful. You hit me after I remember it, I'll forget again. Okay, let's do this. Just can't remember. This is abuse. That's it. I remember it now. I have to buy a sleepy sheet of the rope shop in Roadport and sell it for a two-coin profit in Pedalburg. Let that tip be your reward. Don't spend all those profits. Oh, I mean, that's easier now with the fact that the room thing is right here. That's still a very slow way to earn money, so I'm gonna pass. Let's do another one. I'm, I think one of these will give you your first card for the parlor. Uh, I'm hungry. This is Bumberto. I need you to do some shopping. Please... Come right quick, because I'm starving. Meet me in Roadport out of the docks. Bumberto. No, that's... I'm pressing buttons too quick. Okay. At the docks. Well, there's only two bob -bombs besides Papatch there. 50-50, I talk to the right one first. Oh, Pipe, I love you. And it had for all seven. Including... That's interesting. Chapter seven... Oh, must, never mind. I must go to the outpost, not the base. Okay, no, you're not Bumberto. So you must be Bumberto. Oh, but you land leper, huh? Oh, yeah, right, right. You took on my trouble, eh? My wife brought me a lunchbox to me, but it was empty when I opened it. I'm so hungry I could eat walrus whiskers. You gotta bring me something to eat. How about, a, let's see, whatever, anything, so long as it's food. I'll get to it. How about this? Hey, that looks right tasty. Yep, that hit the spot. Here's your reward. I wonder if it's the value of the thing plus one or something. Like, how is that determined? Because 11 seems like too random of a number. That was really a simple one, though. I probably could have just given him a regular mushroom. I would not do well in the Mario world. I don't like mushrooms. If that's your main form of nourishment and healing, I'd be in big trouble. Although I guess I just have to get used to it. Although it has been a long time since I tried mushrooms. Maybe I'd like them now. I should maybe give that another shot. Try to find me, Kapook. It's me, Kapook, the wandering hide-and-seek champion. I need someone in Hooktail Castle right now. If you find me, I'll give you a member's card for Pianta Parley. You can do it re- Oh, but I want that. Yeah. Yeah, I want that. Yeah, yeah. I do- I do want that. Damn it. Um... I'm trying to think what's faster. It's probably faster just to just go to Pedalburg and go that way. Plus, I get to use this wonderful. Wow, that really makes it so much. Cause especially, okay. The ones that can be annoying. These two are fine. Because it's basically going to the sewer. This one can be very long to get to because you got to go around and around. Well, it's not that long. That's awesome. What a good idea they had here. Alright, back to Hooktail Castle. Wait. 
Weird, I don't think he interacted with the edges of the map in the old ones. That's new. I should save, just in case. Well, hey, Goom... Yeah, Goombelly does extra damage now, so... Should make things a little faster. Oh, you little wiener. You had a... You little weenie, you had a sleepy sheep. Why did I do that? I wanted her to... I wasn't even thinking. She was supposed to... No. Oops, I goofed. I right, distracted by the guy with the item. Where would he be hiding in Hooktail Cave? It has to be someplace I can get to, so it's no... secret areas. Where? I'm just thinking, like, I'm trying to remember how the place layout was. There's no way he's in Hooktail's room, right? Could be. I mean, if you're hiding, that's not a bad place. I haven't had I haven't even had the chance to attack his Goombella yet. Oh, my audience is exclusively Goombas. Yep, that's two. That's nice. I like it. I like that they keep giving me hearts. Bella, you attack the first one, please. Another three battles like that, and I'll hit the next level. Well, Goombella has more health than Mario, because of how I've been managing this. Back to Hooktail Castle. Now, going in here, does it respawn all the enemies that were on the path to Petalburg? Because that would make a big difference. Man, I hope he's, like, in a pretty early part. It just takes so long to get over here. Wait, did I ever check the foreground? Hold on. I don't know that I actually checked the foreground on this side, did I? Anything over here? Nope. Hmm. Okay, well... Do Koopas have one defense or two? If they have one, Goombella's gonna hurt them through their defense now. Oh, she sure does. Very nice. I should have let her attack him. That's fine. Oh, we got two of a kind. Not that I need it. Hey! Oh, but it does fill the audience a little. Alright. My HP sure is full game. I guess, let's see. 
Let me level up, and if I still haven't found him by the time I level up, I'll just cut to when I actually find him. Oh, I'm about to level up, so I guess I'll cut once I find him. Okay. Do the... Or the paratroopers giving me... The paratroopers do give me two. And the Koopas give me one. I see, I see. Okay. That'll bring me to the next level. Which means... Yep, yep. Ooh, ooh, indeed. Badges, please. Yep. So, 18. I started with 3, so I've leveled up 5 times. Actually, can you just outright check your level? Uh, level 6. Okay. Oh, let's equip. I guess I'll just equip everything I can. Alright, well, let me go find this guy, and then I'll be back once I do. Oh, that's a lucky get. Okay, thanks. Uh, back to my, uh, search. Oh, I see him. Target spotted. At least I didn't have to go through the whole castle. At least he's... I mean, it was hard to find him, but he's not exactly hidden. Okay. So, you found me. Curses. I felt sure that none would ever find me here. I'm a master, you see. I love sneaking and hiding so much, I just never stop. It was a hobby, but I kept hiding, and soon I was known as the Hide and Seek Koopa. Koopook? I thought it was you. We used to be neighbors back when we were barely shell high. Koops? Is that you? Yes, Koops, the same Koops who always had to be it when we played Hide and Seek. But you never found me, not even once. Can't believe you finally did it. Yeah, I remember back then, that one day you hid and no one ever found you. Right? That was the very day that I decided to become the Hide and Seek Koopa. Ever since that day, I've hid and snuck and snuck and hid my way through life. Yep, that was a big day. But, since you found me this time, I'll give you what I promised. Yeah. Ooh, the plane mode. Unless this while I was traveling around and hiding around the world. I don't need it. Well enough, time to go look for a new hiding place. Wish me luck. Guess I still got a lot to learn about hiding if you found me, Koops. It was nice seeing you again, though. See you later. Of course, I have to actually go back to town now. So let me do that. Okay, what's next? Listen to me. Oh, we gotta... Oh, the mayor, right. It's just kind of... It's kind of like Koopa Koot stuff from the first game, but not as... Not as, uh, severe. Ah. Uh, that nice, immediately... Immediately accessible fast travel pipe is so nice. Cuts through so many screens. And cuts down on, I guess. Ah, beautiful. Beautiful! And it's right there. Can't beat that. You just can't beat that. Howdy, Mayor. Well, well, Murphy, you must have gotten my request. Good, good. Truth be told, I've been a touch lonely here with no one to talk to. Since you're here, why don't you relax with me for a bit? Indulge in old Koopa. Hmm, to tell you the truth, I've got a few things to say about kids these days. Their tempers are too short for their own good, for one. Makes me want to give them a good, stern finger wagon. Why, I was shopping at the Toad Bros Bazaar the other day. I was trying to pay, and my coin purse was stuck closed. The kid behind me said, Hey, geezer, want to pay so we can get out of here before the sun goes down? 
Now, I may be a geezer, but Sundown was clearly taking longer than I was. Clearly. Speaking of Sundown, it reminds me of dating the missus back before she was the missus. I always had to have her home by Sundown. Yes, sir. Her pa was an absolute maniac. Yep, I keep my eyes on the sun and off the face of my missus. Gentlemanly, eh? Actually, it was sort of awkward, kind of blinding in a painful sort of way. Hey, just thinking about it makes me feel awkward. Heh, <laughs> isn't memory grand? But that's not what I was talking about. Now, where was I? Hmm. Oh, that's right, kids today. They know nothing about patience, I tell you. I want to stand up and yell, Hey, you punks, be more patient, right now. Speaking of which, I think I proclaimed my love for the missus in a loud voice. Yep, she was leaving on a train, and I yelled it from the platform, like in a movie. Now, uh, what was that I yelled to her? Something about her shell, maybe? Oh, wait, I think I've strayed from my main point again, or... Wait, did I? Anyhow, anyhow, me and the missus were madly in love. Head over shells, I tell you. No, wait, my point was something about kids today, right? Aw, oh, whatever. Oh, my dear sweet missus. The way you combed my eyebrows. Such tenderness. Huzzah? Oh, sorry, I got distracted there. Anyway, you get my point. Sorry you had to listen through all that. It wasn't too boring, though, I'd wager. I'm just happy to get a little face time with the, with the youth of today. Oops, I forgot to set out the tea. Aren't I an old ninny? My apologies. In fact, I haven't even added the hot water part. I'm awful sorry. Oh, thanks. Yeah, boy, if you cook a turtle leaf, you can make some amazing tea. Oh, and if you change your mind, you can come back and listen to me yap anytime. Oh, okay. Is that your missus with the nice hat in the back there? And your amazing eyebrows? Wow. Wait. I think he's using the same model as Koops' dad, but with different features. No, it's a little different. Not quite the same. The same model. It's a, it's a flat thing. The same design. Oh. Are there no metal blocks in this game? Is it is it you need the first hammer upgrade for the big blocks and then the second hammer upgrade for the big stone blocks? There's not three hammer upgrades, only two. And it's it's I guess that must be it, because the stone hammer, which is the sec is the first upgrade, breaks big wood blocks. And the metal hammer breaks big stone blocks. You need the next. It's like Minecraft. You need the next, the better material to get the thing. Help me restock, plenty. Our shop inventory is low, and I need someone to help me restock. Please come to the shop in Rogueport Square. Yeah. I'm so happy the the contact lens worked out with him. That would have been so terrible. What does he need me to... What am I going to restock? Do I just give him mushrooms? What could he... What could he need that he doesn't have? Oh. Oh. Wait. When did you get this? Welcome. Yes, welcome to... Ah, you've accepted my trouble, huh, fella? We're having a really hard time finding courage shells. I need you to bring us five from anywhere you can find them, okay? Five courage shells. Okay, well, I need to free up my inventory then. Okay, uh, I need to first sell anything I don't need. I have this turdy leaf because I'm not going to use that. Although I guess I could cook it. And we can have this because I'm not going to use that. And then. Let's store. I'll store this, and this, and this for now. I'm surprised it's still such a limited amount of stuff you can store, considering this is a Switch and not a GameCube memory disc, or memory card. you think you could fit maybe a couple hundred or even thousand items. Oh, I read an interesting factoid about this game. Apparently, in the programming, there is full support for 4K resolution, even though the Switch itself can't do that. 
so it must be a future proofing thing for whatever the next console is going to be and it'll be one of those backwards enhanced features Ah, yep, curd shells. Okay. Yep. I hope he reimburses me. Oh, ten shop points of free mushroom. You shouldn't have, I guess. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Wait, I got enough, right? Yeah. He wanted five. Wow. Okay, he's right. Oh, that that's such... I'm so happy I found that. I could have gone a while without finding that if I wasn't observant. Yep. Yep. Oh, okay. I thought it was going to make me, like, give one, close the menu, give one, close the menu. That's five. You're done. Here's your reward. I hope you like it. Ooh! That's not bad. Okay, that's all the troubles for now. Oh, those little cat things are everywhere. Ooh, let me go before, one last thing. And look at... The parlor. Did I... I unlocked the paper airplane game. Uh, the card, you got a member's card. Okay, I'll prepare the mini game you can play with. Oh. What can I show you? Share my winnings. Oh, there is new stuff. Ooh. Oh, well, they're expensive, though. But. Hmm. If the. Th oh, maple syrup, too. If the thing. If the lottery thing can be exploited, I could get those. Yeah, I want to change. Uh, give me... Ooh, it's a lot. Give me t that many. I want to play the airplane game. B, B, to B. To B, B, to B, B. Okay, um, I want to play the plane game. Oh. Oh, well, there's all my piantas, so let's go. Is Goombella gonna... No, she's not gonna stay here. Ooh. Oh. Ooh, plus three, plus five, times two... Plus ten. Wow, this go. How do you even get that far? Jeez. I don't know that I'm that good at this, anyways. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Oh, and you get a little bonus for that. And one for that. Okay. Boy, that would take a lot of playing to get a lot of piantas for this. Okay, return to counter. Well, I had my fill. Now I'm going to see about the lottery. How much I can mess with that. But, um... Yeah.
Oh, thank you for playing. Come again soon. But don't forget to rescue Princess Peach. But yeah, that's enough for now. So thanks for joining me. Come back on the next stuff up real soon. But until then, bye.